So here's a nice example of an entity that we just don't see that often. Now first and foremost, if you look at the CT images, you realize that the kidneys are not in the correct location. You don't see kidneys in the renal fossa bilaterally, but rather they're both located abnormally medial and inferior, and they appear to fuse at the midline. So this is a classic example of a horseshoe kidney, but I'm not going to show you just a horseshoe kidney. Notice that there's a large hyper-enhancing hypervascular mass arising from the central aspect of this horseshoe kidney and involving really both the right and left renal moieties. And you see the really the same features on MR. It's hypervascular, it's heterogeneous, it's got a central scar. Now this is a clear, classic example of a clear cell renal cell carcinoma arising from a horseshoe kidney. Now if you look at the literature, there is some debate as to whether horseshoe kidney does or does not predispose you to developing renal cell carcinomas. And I think that that's not, uh, that's a debate that's still relatively open. But regardless of what the data shows for populations as a whole, this is clearly an RCC in a horseshoe kidney.